Ah, represent me. Y'all see that? Y'all see that? Yeah, yeah. See that? Oh, 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 oh. See this? Yeah. Representing. Representing. Welcome to episode number 10. This show is called It's Life, dude. Thank you for coming to my blog and checking us out. Uh, yesterday, episode one. I mean, episode nine, part one, for some reason, loaded and then disappeared. I couldn't understand why that happened. It drove me nuts. And then uh, I'm going online trying to figure out how to retrieve information from this computer right here. See that it's still green and it's doing it. It's supposed to take a while to do what it does, but it's been over 45 minutes, so I don't know if it's ever going to do what it's what I wanted to do. Um, yeah, that's that's a little crazy. That's a little crazy. I just wanted to share some music with you guys. Um, hope you guys like uh, some of this stuff I'm about to pull up. But in the meantime, I want to tell you this story. But before I tell you the story, let me get this out the way. Let's not wake up in the morning and have a fat glass of stupid with a bowl of idiot soup. Okay, let's not do that. Let's be patient out here because not having patience will make you a patient. Drive safely on the road, please, please. There are people out here. They could be your family, my family, our family. Uh, treat everybody with the same respect you treat your people with. And we can get there safely. That's that's what we need to do. Let's arrive alive. Let's not have a fat glass of stupid with a bowl of idiot soup and a cup of uh-uh on the side, okay? Let's just think before we act. Be courteous to one another. Let's arrive alive. I see too many accidents every day. Enough of that PSA. Back to where we get and go, where we're going with this. Um, I need to tell this story uh, uh, from a, to a continuation of this story. But we're going to have some music in the background. And we're going to be playing. Oh, wrong one. We're going to be playing some songs. I know. Okay. It's telling me that iTunes is turned all the way down. I know. I know. I know. Let's go to view. The last song we played. Okay. Controls. Uh, let's play story music. Let's see if I can find it. No? Okay. So, I'm not going to play that then. Let me get out of that. Because I want that song to play while I'm telling my story. So please bear with me. Okay. Let's go to story music. Okay. There it is. Okay. I hope you guys can hear me this time. Once again, welcome to It's Life, Dude. I am your host, that dude. Uh, a continuation of this story is... Uh, in 2014, in June, my dad had a stroke. I was at work. It was on a Friday. We were working late that day. I wanted to leave when I got the call, but we couldn't leave because the orders at my job came in really hard and heavy. So I had to stay there and do what I had to do. But my stepmom called me and told me, don't worry about it. Uh, just get there in the morning as soon as you can um, because the doctors are still evaluating them. So Saturday, I got there at his bedside uh, that day. And... Uh, I told him, Pop, you got to hold on. You got to hold on till I get down here. I'll be down here in September. He didn't believe me. September 24th, I was at his house with a U-Haul truck. 
my daughter, my son-in-law. I love those guys so much. Those guys. Oh. Let me pause this because I want to save this song. I want to save that for you guys. But uh, so uh, my daughter-in-law, my son, I mean, my daughter and my son-in-law, uh, they uh, drove the U-Haul. I drove my, I had a whole bunch of work equipment and on the, on the, on the um, they drove the trailer with all my work equipment, and I drove the uh, U-Haul with all of, all my stuff. Now, at the time, you know, at the time it was uh, it was kind of hard because, you know, you know I was married at the time, and uh, you know I told her that we gotta go, we gotta do this and do that. She said, "Okay, go ahead and pack up and this and that." I'm like, "Well, why are you taking so long to?" To, to to get everything ready she told me she said i'll be down in two years oh and that that was something i didn't want to hear so needless to say you know i did move down here in september got down here and uh my my daughter-in-law and i mean my daughter and my son-in-law they they helped me and i got down here my dad did not believe that i was that i was coming he did not he did not believe it he did not believe it. Yep. He did not believe it. None of it. He was, he was, <laughs> he was shocked. He said, well, 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 well damn. You, 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 I ain't, I ain't think you, I, I ain't think you were serious. Damn. <laughs> That's how he talked. You're going to hear, excuse the jets flying over me. It's like they know what I'm recording or something. How you guys like my attire today, huh? I figured I'd get dressed up for you guys a little bit. You know, because, you know, I, I, I do like to uh, get my swag on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But anyway, let me continue my story. Um, So I did end up moving down here in September, and I've been here ever since. Um, I started driving a cab uh, when I came down. And also, you know, a little side hustle. I did. So I'm still doing some stuff to, to, to you know, try to stretch the ducats because it ain't easy down here but uh yeah i started driving a cab i had to hurry and get out that cab because uh uh, uh, uh i'll just say you know uh a young kid tried to try to rob my cab that didn't happen needless to say the next day i went and and uh what is going on excuse my excuse what this all kind of activity going on so uh I, the next day, I got a job where where I'm working now, you know, and uh, and and you know everything worked out, and I also met my 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 baby, you know, my queen. She she's she's magnificent. So needless to say, you know, I'm I'm here. I'm I'm doing the daggone thing, and I came here, and I'm so happy that I I was uh, able to to be here with my dad, you know. Um, this is the reason why all of this is, you know, because he, he, he lived his life. He lived life. And he, we still always say, yeah, that's life. That's why I call this blog. It's life, dude. You know, and I'm that dude, but, uh, you know, he was a jovial man and, you know, it, it, it kind of hurt all of us because it took, uh, he kept having many strokes and, it took something away from him that he cherished, and that that's that's the music. He he loved playing his guitar. You know what I mean? He 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 loved playing his guitar. Now when he had the stroke, it took away his his ability to do so. It, it took away the left side, and so he played. He was right hand. He was right handed, so he played, you know, guitar in this way. You know, and it it took it took a lot out of him. You know what I mean? And it it took away the function for him to do what he liked to do. Now he also sang and you know it, my dad sometimes can be a daggone clown when he he loved being on on the on the stage and and every like family function he would perform all always every and it, it took that that hurt when he couldn't do that so to, to to be able to have his music and i have his music you know and then i have it on this one which is good but then the new stuff that i that i have i i i, I 
I, I, I'm pretty sure I got some on disc, which I hope, and some of the new stuff. But, and I call it new, but it's really not new because he passed in 21. So we made that music in between uh, 2014 and, and, and 21. So uh, the, the, I think we made like four or five songs after the initial tracks we made before he had the stroke. And you guys are going to hear those too, you know. But um, um, yeah, it, 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 it was crazy, you know. It, it, it was really nuts uh, that uh, it, it, it did him like that. And it took a lot of function. But we were, we were able to actually uh, make music, which was good to me, which was great. You know, I'm trying to find uh, songs. Uh, where was it? Don't want to hear it no more. That was on this one. So I want to play that song. Don't want to hear it. Where is it? It's in here somewhere. DJP. There it is. Right there. This is me and my son. I'm playing this song because of our conversation. Listen. All right. I don't want to hurt no more. Too much going on out here for me. I don't want to hurt no more. My son's singing this right here. And I'm doing the background vocals for him. It's beautiful we can do this. I don't. My heart is breaking, my body be shaking, but hold up, cause you know that I'm never flaking, so I stand strong and I can't go wrong, cause I know where it is, where I belong, right here with you, telling you the truth, telling you why I'm here to bust these moves, trying to make a little better life for myself, and everybody else that's in my circle, and understand, listen to the rhythm of the song, cause right now, this right here, it won't hurt you, come on. Yeah. Uh huh. Woo! Yeah. 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 Uh huh. Ah, I hope you guys like that little, little thingy thing we did right there for you. You know what I mean? Uh. You know. Let me see. I'm going to play something else for you right here. This is my nephew right here. Ah, oh, it's not on here. Son of... Hmm. I'm going to find it. It, it. I got it. It's, it's there. But I'll just play what we were going to play earlier. Uh, acoustic Soul. Where is it? Acoustic Soul. I'll let you hear that. There it is. Enjoy, folks. I 
hope you like this. Ghost. This is the ghost right here. It's my partner. I am serenity. Silence is sad, a beautiful sound. I feel peace that I haven't felt before. And when the rhythm stops, I, I want to feel more. more. Let it go, let the beat flow. Music is my life, I feel it in my soul. Now, let me know, folks, if you think that should be uh, like the intro. My story must be told through rhythm and rhyme. Um, that song is called Acoustic Soul. Uh, my friend, we'll call him the ghost. My partner, he was my rhyme partner for many, many years before he passed at the top of the, this year. But uh, uh, he named that song this Acoustic Soul. Well, did, did he? I think he did. Uh, I, don't get me the line. I don't want to. I don't want to be fabricating the fabrication here. But yeah, I, I think he did. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not sure. I got to go back in my archives and, and dig this out because the thing about my friend the ghost, uh, he could tell stories like nobody's business. Um, oh my God, that dude. Uh, we when we started out, you know. <laughs> it, it was crazy because one, I ain't trust him, and I ain't like him. Only reason I didn't like him, and I'm gonna be truthful, because he 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 was dating my sister, and I I I you know, and he had an arrogance about him, you know, that I didn't like. And 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 you know, you know, we grew up in the same hood, but we ended up, you know coming together over music, literally, uh, because uh, actually we ended up coming together basically over, at first, uh, karate movies, because I love 
Uh, uh, man, Sundays was the days. Oh, I ain't talking about David Carradine neither. I'm talking about, you know, you know, the uh the 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 Wu brothers, you know. Oh, oh. I miss it. It was great coming to coming up when I was coming up. Every kid in the neighborhood would be in the house on a Sunday watching Kung Fu movies because that was the thing. But that's what we came together over. Um, uh, the first the Kung Fu movies, and then we started writing music together. Uh, you know, back in the days when I was younger, you know, I used to partake of the Bob Marley. We all did back in the days, you know. And uh, um, Sundays was the day we wake up, and I'd be at my sister's house. He'd be there, you know, my nieces and nephews running around. They were little, little kids. And this was in uh, 80, this was in 80, before I had my daughter, so we, that was 80, we started coming together through the music through uh, like 85. Uh, that's when we really started really getting to know each other, okay, in around 85. 86 is when my daughter was born. So we, we made our first song in 86 because my daughter was, my oldest daughter was born after, after that. So uh, Sunday mornings, we would, we would sit at the, at the table at my sister's house, you know, partake of the Bob Molly, have a cup of coffee and be writing songs. Uh, my uncle, he had a studio in his house. So we would go over there and we would record our music there. Um, um, and and uh, thanks, uncle. Cause uh, you 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 helped me to create all of this, um, um, for real for real. And he he's he's gone too. All of the all the all of all of our people, man. Just everybody's just falling to the wayside. It's, it's crazy, but yeah. So that's that's how all of this came to be from the beginning, you know. And then '86 is when I started playing in in the band with Primetime, you know. They cut. And that's that's how it all came. But this that song you hear, acoustic flow. Um, was we made that song after a night of making a whole bunch of music. I think that week we were just we were just making. I think we made four or five songs that week. Some were incomplete, but we ended up finishing everything we did um, that week because it, it that night when we made this song, it it was like almost two or three o'clock in the morning, and you can hear how relaxed everything was because it was quiet. And that that was the quiet time because the rest of the family was sleeping, and we were in the studio still making this so you know this is uh just some stories but yeah and the reason i say that this is it's life dude because my pop you know he he he's the one you're gonna hear that song that we did called it's life but i just wanted to give you guys a little bit of uh more of what it is that we do you're gonna hear more um uh i don't want to hurt no more that was my son and myself um uh, uh, that boy's a beast. He's his catalog is just as big as mine's. That and, and my nephew, I, I got nephews who who are who are, whew, Lord, and they all started out in, in my studio. You know what I mean? My niece's cousins. You know that boy can sing. Oh my gosh, I I got so much music. It's crazy. You guys are gonna hear it. I hope you enjoy it. But uh, this is just a piece of me. You know. And you know what what it is that I'm dealing with and going through and 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 this thing that we call life, but that's what it is. It's life, dude. Thank you. <laughs>